Hey guys, Mitch here. So iOS 6 Beta 2 still lacks support for Apple's new Passbook app in iOS 6. Now this website, known as Passsource.com, allows you to get your iOS 6 Passbook passes for your Passbook app. They have tons and tons of passes ranging from your boarding passes to your coupons to different um, LA fitness cards, Starbucks gift cards, down to your basic rewards cards. Now it's really easy to actually get these cards in your Passbook application. All you do is go ahead and select one of the cards here. In this case it is the boarding pass here. You will see some information uh, revealing the date of when it is, the name of the airway. You can customize the background color, the foreground color, along with the, your, uh, your transit time, if you want to have air train, bus, you can customize those, you have your name. Anyway, at the very bottom you want to go ahead and click create and a little preview of your pass will be created here. We do have the Skyport Airways and your uh, bottom card here and if you go ahead and select add it will be added to your passbook application here. So I've already created a bunch of passes here so here we do have our Skyport Airways. If you do create multiple ones, you can easily slide over to the right to reveal your other um, passes here. We also have our LA Fitness here of Tim Cook here. We have our GameStop Power Up Rewards here, our Apple Event. We have our 20% off gift card here. And there's a bunch that you can customize right from Passsource.com. Now if you go ahead and actually open up the information about this, you can see we do have the notifications here. If you want to reveal when there are updates for these passes, you can keep that on, along with the show the lock screen on. Now if you go ahead and at the bottom here you want to update the pass, you can go ahead and use that link of the pass sources website. And if I go ahead and change out, let's change out the uh, departing time here. So I change that out to be 220 instead of 225 and I click done. I will have to update the pass. Then the pass will become updated. It will give you a preview and if I go ahead and update it you will get a banner notification at the top revealing that the Skyport Airways has been changed to 220. So it's a nice way to see your updated passes with iOS 5 banners right in your iOS 6. Uh, passbook. Now if you go ahead and want to delete one of these passes here you can go into the information about it and the little delete button here will be at the top and it's a cool little animation of almost like a shredder as your pass does get deleted so you can do these to any of the passes here. We do have Tim Cook's LA Fitness. You can easily go ahead and delete it and the pass will be shredded. So guys this is how you get iOS 6 passbook passes right for your iOS 6 device. If you guys do like these videos, don't forget to give a like up, leave any comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to stay updated. Thanks guys.